everybody and welcome back to another video so today we're actually going to be doing a relatively small one i wasn't able to do this before for the moon fire fair but yeah today we're just going to be doing a quick glance at the next event that's coming to eorzea which is coming very quickly so yes it's that time of the year again for the rising event so the two of them are kind of back to back now. I do know that most of the time the Moonfire Fair comes out a little bit earlier, usually around uh, like the end of June, uh, the middle of July or something like that. They did push it back a little bit this time. Not surprising. But yes, today we have the Rising event. So basically what the Rising event is, is that it's celebrating kind of the destruction of 1.0 and it's celebrating the rebirth of a brand new realm, a brand new game. And so on August 27th this year, we have the Rising event. It marks the 8th anniversary of the Rising. And so you can join in the rest of Eorzea in celebrating this momentous occasion. And the artwork here is very beautiful this time. In fact, it always is beautiful. I don't know why I say it this time. But here we have an image of the Wandering Minister, and we have a... I'm guessing that this is going to be one of the journalists. We usually see them during these events. But here we have what looks to be the city of Udal in the background. Uh, we have like the stage in the background here as well. We kind of had the stage set up every year for the last couple of years. And we have this beautiful, gorgeous full moon in the background. So I'm wondering what that's all about. So on your unending road, may each dawn find you safe. So this is going to be a special seasonal event that's going to be taking place August 27th, which is next Friday. And it's going to last until Thursday, September 9th. So we got about two weeks there, I guess almost three weeks for us to be able to sit back, enjoy and actually have a good time. So you can actually unlock this quest from Udal, the Steps of Nal. So you can actually accept it from Kippi Jakaya. And that's a mouthful there. And she's actually just standing outside just the Udal main etherite crystal, so you can't miss it. So the quest is going to be called Rising Calm, and the only request that we need is that we have to be at least a level 15. Kipai Jakia is looking around in consideration. So let's also look at the event items that we can get from this year. We have only two of them here, and it's a little surprising because we normally get like a couple minions to go along with it. This year it doesn't look like we're getting any minions. A little bit disappointing. So this is actually an accessory. So you can actually just carry around a, a red and white parasol that actually has the emblem of the meteor on it. So this elegant parasol features an image of a flaming moon, which seems strangely familiar used to acquire a red moon parasol. So this is just a random accessory that you can have. I'm sure you've seen it plenty of times. Uh, nothing too special there. And we also have a new kind of firework. This here is the Nimia Potpourri. Made from the alchemically treated petals of Nimia lilies, this fragrant bundle of potpourri brings a sense of tranquility to even the most troubled souls. So I have a feeling this is going to be a very interesting Ryzen event just from that alone. So you can actually see a good picture here of what they look like. Here's the parasol. You see the flaming moon emblem, which is kind of like the main scenario questline emblem. And you can just pull that out and actually wear it whenever you want to, rain or shine. It doesn't matter. I'm not judging. And here are the fireworks. So this here is like a beautiful bouquet of lilies and like lily petals being scattered everywhere. So that, that's really nice. It's really gorgeous. I love that idea. So nothing too special it looks like, but I'm looking forward to it as well. Um, again, it doesn't really look like there's going to be too much information about that. It's really not too surprising. But yeah, that's everything that's going to be coming for the Ryzen event. We have a lot to prepare for and a lot to look forward to so i'm really really excited to see what's going to happen especially after everything that's been going on this year and the rising event is always a really good show if you ask me so this is just the dev team like yoshi p and his entire team everyone who's worked on this game this is their chance of actually thanking the players for being a part of the final fantasy 14 community being a part of this entire world and it really is a very special occasion, so I'm really looking forward to all that. Anyway, everyone, I think that's going to be it for right now. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed it, and that you're going to be looking forward to the rising event. So until next time, everyone, take care, and this is Fantasy Girl signing out.